boy. Is that the cool thing to say or no? Um, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, what are you spending your day to day doing? Right now, currently juggling. And you changed it back from 125 to whatever it should be? Yeah. And the audio is recording? Yeah. Okay. All right, so a lot of people um, waste so much time during their work day instead of actually being productive. So in today's video, I want to talk about the three things that you can actually eliminate to save yourself at least 15 hours a week. All right, let me get out of the way here since there's people in here. Um, okay, so thing number three that I want to, or thing number three, thing number one is making sure that you are eliminating time uh, talking on social media when you should be doing stuff at work. So the easiest way to do this is actually just deleting the apps off of your phone. So I've recently deleted Facebook off my phone. I do still have Instagram, but Facebook was the biggest thing that I was spending so much time uh, wasting. And so what I'll still do is Facebook is like essential to the growth of my business. So I don't want to just completely go off Facebook, but it's what I'll do is just have dedicated times that I'll just hop on for 10 minutes at a time and uh, go through, back through, look through all my notifications and uh, respond to people that need to be responded to. But then as soon as I'm done, I'm done. I'm not just mindlessly scrolling on Facebook. Uh, the second thing is to stop wasting your time on meetings that are not crucial or essential. So a lot of times people reach out to you and be like, hey, I would love to set up a one-to-one -one meeting with you and learn more about your business. Uh, what I find is while that's good at the very, very beginning of your business, just to get you used to talking to people, what it will do is it'll actually suck up your time when you should be doing things that are actually helping drive your business growth. So what I've done to combat that is I'll just set up every month a time where I can invite all these people to come together and they can all meet each other and they can all meet me and we can all talk together. And then if it's really important for them, then they're gonna actually make sure that they make it to that meeting. Um, if it's not that important to them, they won't come and that's okay, just move on from it. Um, and then thing number three, what was thing number three, Zach? <laughs> texting and phone calls. Thing number three is texting and phone calls. This sounds really horrible. Mama, I love you, but number one thing that would always distract me is um, my mom and my best friend and my husband would just call me randomly, text me randomly throughout the day. And that's horrible to not answer your mom's calls. But what I ended up saying to them is during the actual business day, like nine to five while I'm actually working, please don't call me, text me unless it's an emergency because then I can really stay focused. As well as that, there's actually, you know, people, your friends on social will text you and be like, hey girl, you wanna go out this weekend? What are you doing after work? What's going on? Like just questions that aren't actually helping you. And every time you have to stop and figure out, you know, answer them and then get back into your day, that's like 20, 30 minutes of wasted productivity time. So just training people around you, like the wait to call you after work and then you can get back to them, especially if they're people that you care about and you need to continue those relationships. So those are my three tips. Those are three things I want you to think about if you are wanting to um, save time from your work day and make sure that you are super focused on the things that you need to be focused on. And so now I'm going to get into this line and order my chai latte because I've had a super productive day.